NSW Real Estate. Sydney prepares for biggest auction day of the year. Sydney is set for the biggest auction day of the year tomorrow with more than 1,000 homes going under hammer. This year's spring selling season had attracted some of the lowest stock levels in 20 years, but the drought appears to finally be lifting. There are more than 940 auctions scheduled for the city and more than 1,100 for the whole of NSW, up 20% on last week. While Super Saturday is coming much later than usual, industry experts are forecasting the bumper weekend is a sign to things to come. CoreLogic auction commentator Kevin Brogan said, while Sydney's overall auction listings had been lower this year auction clearance rates had accelerated. We've consistently seen clearance rates above 80% in Sydney, this time last year they were closer to 60%, Mr. Brogan said. And Real Estate Institute of NSW President John Cunningham said the market was showing no signs of slowing down. Traditionally we see a bit of a cool down the closer you get to Christmas and the New Year. Already we're seeing auctions being scheduled right up to Christmas Day, Mr. Cunningham said. Ben Farmer and his wife Amanda are selling their house at 70 West Street, North Sydney, tomorrow and said they'd been monitoring the market carefully for the right time to sell. We'd been watching the market for about six months and thought spring would be the best time to sell, Mr. Farmer said. Agent Piers Van Hamburg of McGrath Neutral Bay said he was expecting to see big results this weekend. The auction pickup has come much later this year, but the market couldn't be more competitive, he said. In other news, Hain lists Paddington Palace for sale. John McGrath discusses real estate 20 years from now.